hopping. The Aqua Mop is the ultimate bucketless mop, where instead of using a bucket of dirty mopping solution to clean with, you use a small container mounted on the handle of the mop. And clean solution is dispensed in front of the microfiber mop head where and whenever you require it. Dry microfiber mop heads attach to the Velcro head of the Aqua Mop. These mop heads are designed to dust mop and clean in one process. First you will need to choose the best mop head for your type of floors. For cleaning of normal floors, use the clean and dry mop heads. These heads have been designed to mop right into the corners, as the microfiber wraps itself around the edges of the mop. This makes it very easy to mop edges and skirting. The mop is shaped so that when you mop in a forward direction, it will not flip over if your mop head becomes dry. The mops are colour coded for separate use in washroom, kitchen, general and infectious areas. And they are also marked with single area cleaning on the labels. This means each head should only be used in a single area and hence a new head should be available for the next area to be cleaned. If you are cleaning washrooms or dirty areas requiring scrubbing and you want the surfaces left as dry as possible, then you should use the scrub and dry Velcro covers. These heads are made with 30% polypropylene scrubbing strips mixed with 70% ultra-fine microfiber. These mops will scrub through grime and also leave your floors practically dry. These heads are available in red washroom and blue general colours for heavy duty cleaning and for cleaning non-slip floors usually requiring scrubbing. The extra microfiber clots inserted in this mop will cause the mop to act like a baby's nappy, continually pulling moisture away from your floor. The best place to keep your mop heads is in the 10 or 20 litre buckets. This bucket should be mounted on the lower area of your trolley so it is easy for you to pick up a clean one with the base of your aqua mop. After picking up the cover, press the button on the handle to release solution onto the floor in front of your mop. Run the mop diagonally through the solution to moisten your mop and start by cleaning the skirting and edges around your room. Keep moving your mop in a figure eight pattern, keeping the leading edge of the mop forward at all times. Press the button to release more solution when needed and continue mopping from the furthest point towards your trolley at the exit point of your room. When that area is finished, lift the mop while standing on the edge of the cover and then pick up the cover with the Velcro and put it in the bag for later laundering.